Marvin. Trust me. <laughs> That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. You already know what time it is. It's time for more of The Witcher 3. And man, it has been a little bit. I don't want to drag this out or anything like that. Those of you guys that have been keeping up to date with things on the Discord server or in the community tab or Patreon and so forth and somewhat, you know, uh, you guys should already understand. Uh, but I did originally plan to take a little break from this series. Just uh, I wanted to take a little bit longer than usual for the next episode, just so I can kind of gauge the reaction <laughs> to uh, the decision in the last episode. It was quite the decision we ended up having to make. And just as I figured, there was definitely, oh, whoa, whoa, I didn't mean to attack that guy. Um, there was definitely some divisiveness among things. Today, we are gonna be taking on the Cave of Dreams quest. Uh, you guys let me know that you guys definitely want me to handle this one and the ones from the higher ups that talked to uh, Geralt a little while ago to help out with their kids, etc. And those are the quests we're probably going to focus on. I don't know how long this episode is going to be. I'm sure you guys already know, though. But my main objective is to do the Cave of Dreams quest this episode. I don't know how long it'll take, but we're going to record as long as I can and I ease our way back into things. And I'm, I'm really excited for this. If you guys haven't already, hit the like button for you, boy. And leave a comment for the algorithm. You have no idea how much that really helps out, especially since we haven't uploaded in a little while. I could take all the interaction I can get. So leave a like, leave a comment. It really helps me out. And subscribing to the channel will keep you notified for when new episodes go out. I do tend to post these early on Patreon. So if you are interested in seeing them uncensored, uncut and stuff like that and as soon as they're done recording then patreon is definitely the way to go it's never required or anything like that but it does really ensure that i can do this full time and it really goes a long way so thank you guys so much for watching and i hope you enjoy the video all right we're back on the old road again we're back on the old road again you're not following the road okay okay man we're back in we're really back in it it feels kind of <laughs> funny to be uh, playing uh this game again man i've i've missed it i'm not gonna lie again i'm not gonna go too much into it here don't no need to immortalize it in a video okay ah whoa oh okay f5 what a time to be alive y'all know how it goes around here oh hello oh oh Hey, let's see if I, ooh, that, that hurt a lot less than I thought it was going to. Okay, I'm poisoned. Go, there you go. Yeah, he, he can use that to block. Whoa, that still hit me? Don't lie to me. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay. Not the smartest idea I've ever had. Okay. Bro, why is how is he able to hurt me when I Bro, the what is the hitbox, bro? Like dang. You're going to need to dodge twice. OK, he didn't hit me there. OK, hold up. I have an idea. Mm. Whoa, man, give me a break. Okay. Sometimes it's better to run. You're not jumping that far. Don't lie to me. Gonna die in a second, buddy. Okay. Ah. Uh, what a guy. And, the, and he's pretty close to town too. So like, th that's why I always wonder like how to freak, like 
these worlds, like the worlds with monsters, even exist and stuff like that because that'd be so crazy to me. Um, let me take a good look at the map again. Um, we're going the right way. I think it was trying to f optimize a path by telling me to go the other way. Hold up. I might need to meditate a little bit just to get that stuff all situated. Okay. Huh. I have a feeling something else is out here. I hear something. Oh, that's another one. Dude, this just feels like the perfect battleground right now. I know it might not seem like it because of the uneven terrain, all the different uh, flora and fauna out here, but man, why is this out here? Ruins? Dude. Oh. Some dudes got washed. Okay. I wonder if this was part of a quest. I hear sounds and noises. I don't like sounds or noises. Two things I hate the most. Ooh, we'll take those. Petri's filter. That didn't even look like there was something. Hmm. That's the thing about the Witcher senses. They definitely just make everything seem louder. Everything except for like natural sounds like the the wind and such they make that seem quieter but actual noises made from living beings and stuff are a lot louder okay no way out of this one hey guys oh i don't have stamina i forgot i just use ow oh, okay It's been a while as I've been thrust back into the jaws of what's known as life. I've come to appreciate more of my surroundings. Ah, beautiful. It has that, that unkept kind of beauty, you know, not like the beautiful, like if you, if you drive through a really beautiful neighborhood and stuff because it's so upkept and stuff, that's a beauty all on its own. But like, this feels different. You know, it's the it's the opposite of that. It's that natural beauty, that all natural. I appreciate that. That's it. Bro. I'm actually playing this game with uh, lossless scaling. I've actually explained it in a video before, so I won't re-explain it here. But um, I actually came out with an update today for uh, the frame gen, and it definitely makes the game even higher FPS than before then it will probably what's even capable in this game. The only thing I notice is that there's definitely more input delay and I don't like that. So I'm debating on turning it off. Mostly because I can tell that when I do an action, it takes a split second longer for it to actually execute in the now. game. Those bandits. No, 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 these are the blue boy Lugos and his crew. Let's uh let's hit an F five real quick. He's an old then or a berserker. Shut up. I F fived. What do you want? Wanna talk to Blue Boy Lugos. <laughs> Hear that? He wants to talk to Lugos. What else, Vagrant? Care to plow Freya? Lugos is expecting me. Yes, use Lugos it. Is expecting me. Lead the way. The Right. Come on. Why? I don't get it. Then stay here. Think it over. <laughs> I don't know. All right, are you going to go and lead the way? I guess I'm leading the way. Why couldn't I just talk to Lugos from there? No, the last time I had a Continental on my ship. No. When I hauled prisoners from Velen to the slave market in Nazar. Now, tell me why you're here. Want to hire a witcher? Your father sent me. 
Ooh, want to hire a witcher? Your father sent me. Your father felt you could use a witcher's help, and I owe him a favor, so... Told him not to meddle. Told him I'd manage fine on my own. Maybe that's not entirely true. Cave of Dreams. Supposed to be a dangerous place. Mortally so. But that's my reason for going there. Fine, so be it, I take ya. Old man's like to throw a fit elsewise. Or he's about to go. You ready? I'm ready. What's in the Cave of Dreams? What awaits us in the Cave of Dreams? Depends wholly on us, cuz... Uh, I'd explain later. I assume it's different for each occupant, you know, something called the Cave of Dreams. I assume it's if it's supposed to be so dangerous and with that name, I assume it kind of attacks you based off like your dreams. We can go. Is it far? Nah, stone's throw. Let's gather the lads and go in. We'll know soon if there's truth to the legends. All right, guess we're finding it out. Y'all been waiting on this, Yarl, so I hope y'all hit the like button already. The They'll come with us. You know Yarlf, called the Wolverine? Good day. And this here's Oov Jabberjaw. Oh, they call him that. <laughs> Oov seems quiet to me. Why is Oov so quiet? Because he got no tongue. What happened? He lick a frozen blade. No. He tore it out because he cursed King Bran while drunk. Lost his power to speak, but kept his honor. Interesting customs you got here. Okay. What do you expect to find in the cave? Before we head off, will you tell me about this cave? You could at least tell me what we might have to fight. Only you can know that. Elders say in the Cave of Dreams you face your greatest fears. Face what makes you wake up at night, screaming. Something that's already been, will be. Or just might be. It's more Too like Cave of Nightmares. Slayer fears. But we've talked enough, lads. Swords in hand. Let's go. I am curious because, like, that sounds more like a Cave of Nightmares to me. I know fiction often uses nightmares and dreams synonymously, whatever works and stuff. And Cave of Nightmares just sounds better. A, a Cave of Dreams probably sounds better. I know a thing or two about a cavern of dreams, you know? Oh, yeah. huh. If there's one thing I'm not afraid of, it's neckers. Whoa. Oh, I don't know if I can play with this input delay. I'll have to turn it off in a second and see if it's that bad. Oh, I'm, oh hold on. I'm turning that joint off. All right, it's off. I can immediately tell the difference, too. You know I'm not losing no neckers and stuff, bro. Come on, that that's not happening. Just ignore that time I died to those wolves. Dang, I'm kind of surprised. Maybe I should use a swallow. Can't loot him. No, I can. No. The totem, right where it should be. Now's when we eat the herbs. Why would we do that? To go on, to where the nightmares are. So says the legend, and so we will do. What are these herbs? What herbs are these? Mm, what that druid say? Hemlock, poppy, nightshade, and that chicky, no, uh, henbane. Whoa, in for one hell of a ride. Fine, give him here. Fine, give him here. Take it, Oove. Yarlf, eat up to the last grain. Oh boy. We're about to get to that one segment in Mother 3. I don't feel no different. How about you, Oove? <laughs> You're asking a mute his opinion. You're feeling it, mate. Bruh. Come on, let's go. Time to face our fears. Okay. Wait, so like, can I, can I like heal? Or like, can I get my like swallows back? I'm, I'm curious. No, I cannot. Whoa, what the freak, bro? That 
Gerald, I don't think that's what you're, uh... Hey, where are you going? Where are you going? No, 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 I'm not losing sight of you. See it? The Razorback! Clear up high! A too big for a Razorback. That's a blue. We're all seeing the same thing? With that short of snout, carbs are robbed you your senses. Well, what happens if we keep following it? Is it just going around in circles? It's definitely going around in circles. The boys even left me behind. Dang, bro. We're supposed to be tripping together. Come on, y'all. Let me hit F5. What a time to be alive. I see you're weary from the battle. Sit with me, son. Have some mead. Pray telling your adventures. Thank you, my king. I shan't drink with you, old man. And I shan't call you king. Get off that throne while you still strengthen your decrepit bones. Huh? Oof. You can talk. Uh. I... I, I, I didn't... But I... Oh. You suck me once more, old Jabberjaw. The first time I left you to punish yourself and retain your honor, but now, now you'll die like a troll and eels will eat your remains. Oh, shoot. Come on, now we we oh, dude, we're fighting nothing out here, bro. Okay, who doesn't have a, uh, a health bar? I was wondering if it was going to do, like, something we've seen in the past. Or you kind of have to like, there's an optional objective to, to help them. Okay. Wait. I don't have my stamina. Show me what you got. Nothing. Okay, I need to to long go. Oh, did he die, I guess? Okay. Whoa, I didn't want to target that guy. There we go. The shield dudes are the worst. The shield broke. Whoa, what the freak, bro? What now? Why are you? Why is he taking so long to kill? I'm not doing any damage to him. Wait. There. Whoa. Why is that moving? Oh, the, the world's kind of moving. Oh, whoa. Okay. Hey, look, flying fish. What's strange about that? See them at sea every few crests. I be those they got wings. These here. It's as if they're swimming through the air. That's true. Hmm. Let's go around this way first. Looks like it all leads up to the same place, so. Enemy sprang up. Auto save. Okay. A siren. Oh, bro, we're gonna lose somebody here, ain't we? Yes. Oh, I'm gonna have to censor something this episode, aren't I? Tis your father's it, it's tasteful enough to where it'll be all right. Our sweet song. 
I kill you! Kill all you plow and seahorse! Slay us, tribe. But you're not restored. Here's the light. You slew him. A son who killed his father. Oh, oh. Okay, so I assume um, if I, I, I was getting that correctly, uh, at sea, a siren, uh, he fell under a, a siren's, I guess, spell or a song. And in that state, he ended up killing his father. Mm. So now he kind of has it out for all of uh, them now. Interesting. Come on, stop, bro. Dice come. Okay, wrong button. Who are you shooting, Geralt? That was it. Okay. Jarl, it was an accident. The Althing cleared your blame. But they couldn't clear my conscience. Let's go. See. All right. The world is still kind of turning and stuff. I hope we don't have any uh, motion sick uh, viewers today. I know I've kind of been in the darkness here. Guess it's time to take a cat. Is that going to be outside? It's a witcher's nightmare. Nope. This is daily life for us. Ow. Ooh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't want to use it yet. Nope. Nope. Ah. Uh. Didn't show it this time because I, I mean, you know how many water hags we've killed? It's fine. Um, I'm starting to think something, by the way. It's nice to have enhanced cats, but I also don't have any food set up right now. And I would kind of like that at the moment. Just because we only have one left. I don't think we're going to get up to any poison, so I think it'll be okay if we get rid of that. Um, anything heal 15, 15, 15, ah, dried fish. Hold up, does this, this chicken do that? How about this fish? Fish seems to be pretty good with that. Wait, did that say ham sandwich? Where's the bread? All right, well, there we go. All right. Must be my dream. I don't fear nothing. So, like, so are they all just doing this shared dream? I, I kind of thought it, it would this it wouldn't go like this. You fear nothing, boy. You, you pissed your trousers when Nathan struck the tree by our fall. I was three years old. I've shown a hundred times since then that I... You pissed yourself before the whole village. The Yarl son. Ha! The shame should have punished you. Bro, he was three years old, bro. What? You're a vision. A specter. A vision of your dog, who you fear, because you know you don't live up to him. You know you disappoint him. I'm a better warrior than he ever was. Prove it, you little shite. All right, here we go. Dude, I can't even see because of this cat potion, bro. Oh, man. Uh, 
What's the best way to do this? Okay. Dude, can this cat wear off, please? I can hardly see his attacks. Oh. Who's the better warrior now? Who? Lugos, leave him. It's only a vision true, but it's not proper. Yeah. He, he, and he is still a respectable figure. Oh, what the freak is Geralt doing? That's not the first time. Sometimes I feel like my, I just randomly can't control a character anymore. That's weird. Again, this is not the first time that's happened. Sometimes I feel like, like from a programming perspective, inputs can add up. Uh, some like sometimes they don't execute on command and they stack. So in the end, like when they do execute, they end up just playing in sequence of a bunch of inputs that you ended up doing over the last like couple seconds. That's what I think happens. Okay, here we go. Who's this? Oh, this is Geralt, isn't it? King, King of the Wild Hunt. Oh, we're at Kermorin, aren't we? I just realized we're at, we're at Kermorin. Oh yeah! Now we <sighs> Doing this with barely any heals is. Okay. I guess I'll go up to this one. Okay. Okay, he's dead. Okay. What's up, buddy? Whoa. Oh, dude, I hope we actually do get to actually fight him in this game. I, I bet you we will. Oh, my goodness. He doesn't do nearly as much damage as, as, as I thought. Probably because it's just a vision. Where's everybody else? <laughs> she will still be mine. Over my dead body. Nothing simpler. No. I see why uh, he wanted us to come with his son because I'm not gonna lie, homeboy was not making it out of here. Get up, Garrett. What? You've paid your debt. You're a free man. Gonna tell your father what you faced in the cave of dreams? No. Nope. Of course I will. I've no fear of him, right? Hey. What an honor to fight at your side. Farewell, Geralt. That's just how it ends. I kind of wish there was a better conclusion than that. It was cool to see what Geralt's fears were at the end. And did he, and he, we didn't beat him just then. If you notice that, I feel like that was definitely symbolic. We definitely didn't beat him in that that dream. So I have a feeling, you know, the fear persists even now. Huh. Wait. So did we actually finish it? Looks like it's done. Okay. Um I guess it it's done. I don't I don't see it in here anymore, so I assume we did it. We only need to be level 14 for that, so it was a pretty weak quest. I actually don't see that it's name nameless. No, no, that that's already done. Okay, well, Cave of Dreams, yeah, it's it's done. 
I mean, I, we would have known that if I just waited another second. I am curious to continue on inside this place. I'm wondering, will we see something in here? I don't think so. Actually, the cave doesn't even continue. Wow, that's really neat. This is the entrance, so the cave never actually went on. I, I think they all dang near passed out right there. I think they all passed out and everything we faced wasn't even real. I don't, I don't know. I still use them swallows. Was I chugging them joints in my sleep? <laughs> That's the only thing that makes sense. Chugging them in my sleep, my HP. Am I punching myself in the face when I was asleep? Oh, here we are. Sometimes it's nice that like when we get taken somewhere, you know, it's fine. It's like, actually, I think we, we did straight up just come here. Could we have experienced the cave of dreams on our own, even without the quest? Kind of wondering. And you guys definitely said that, uh, oh, oh, blood moss. You guys said doing the next story quest would definitely, um, oh, wolves, I assume. Uh, you guys definitely told me that it would cancel out some of these quests that I've been doing. So, yeah, let, let's not worry about that. That was a lot shorter than I thought it was going to be. So, yeah, let's do something else now. Um, okay, so, um, let me try to figure out which one I want to do next. Okay, so I believe I'm going to do possession next, um, where we have to ask Alderic where Ceres is, um, mostly because I believe this is the companion quest to what we were just doing for Cave of Dreams. Uh, we have both, I think it's both of the Jarl's children uh, both kind of are doing something that's really stupid on their own and probably going to get them both killed. So uh, one was the Cave of Dreams quest, and I believe this is the other one. Concern filled Croc's voice and something else. Pride, the Jarl had pulled Geralt aside during King Bran's wake to confess his worries about his daughter, Ceres. She had sailed to Spikerook, seeking to cure Jarl uh, Ulderic's mysterious affliction, a dangerous mission, though one that would certainly be less so with the Witcher's help. Geralt eyed his old friend over carefully, then made his decision. For some reason, I still feel like this isn't the one. I know there's another one, too, where this one, um, I believe this one, um, th this is also it, too. Um, th this is tied to it as well, but this is, you're not helping the Jarl son, you're helping, a uh, Croc's son, um, because he is also vying for the throne, I believe. And so this is just another one where we have to basically take uh, help him take out a giant, I believe. So depending on how long they are, we might just end up doing these two. I looked at the next one and we already started the wolf's clothing one and uh, nithing doesn't seem related to it. But uh, depending on how long this video ended up being, we could end up doing both of these. Uh, so I I'd like it be not it'd be nice. OK, um, so let's do this one next. It's probably not too far from what I'm assuming. Never mind. It is very, very far away. Um, it's on one of the islands. And actually, we have a teleport there. Swarlag. OK. Well, that sounds good to me. Swarlag seems like we're going to be making a little bit of a distance out. We do need to buy more of these uh, maps. I, I talked about it before, but you guys definitely told me I should buy as many of those maps as I can just because, yeah. Does not seem like there's any kind of fast travel nearby. I don't even see any question marks on the map. So we're in for a little bit of a ride here. So I guess we're going to try to make our way back to the port so we don't have to go all the way up the mountain to where the mirror is at. And I know you guys told me, too, that I can actually go back and pay off my debt to the guy who got me out of jail. But before technically it was during this recording, but it, I wasn't recorded. Um I did look around to try to see who I have to talk to in that situation, but I legit couldn't find I couldn't find them. So I, I just don't I don't know who I was supposed to talk to. So uh, maybe you guys can give me uh, something else and or maybe I'll, I'll actually go and properly look because I, I went there and, and I, I just looked around. I didn't I didn't properly look, but I looked around because I thought it might be obvious to see like with like a uh, an objective marker of some kind, but I didn't see that. So. I don't know, but yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. All right, you have no idea what it took me to get here. I definitely had to reload a save during that <laughs> accident, mostly because <laughs> I think I accidentally stole something in front of somebody and uh, they were not happy about that. 
and the enti the entire harbor just started attacking me. <laughs> it was an accident. It was a complete and freak utter accident. But you know what? It's fine. I just had to reload a save that took me all the way back to the end of the last quest and then redo it. But it's fine. That's a new contract. Ooh, I do love me a good contract. But I've wasted some time already. Why does it always lead me to the back of the house? Stop doing that. Stop leading me to the back of the house. I mean, I know I should, shouldn't just be blindly following the map because there's a door obviously right here. But stop doing that. Please. And now that I'm inside the house, there's nobody to stop me. There's nobody to stop me. I will take everything you hold dear. Yes, including your raspberry juice, your water, and even the apple juice. Hello. We'll be done in a moment. <laughs> and then a giant sea snake swam up and bit my arm off. The gods have spoken. A sacrifice is needed. To my mind, it's about you defeating a snake, Yah. No. They demand a sacrifice. I'm sure of it. It's time. We must wait for a clearer sign. At least till your next dreaming. I don't need no more signs. Oh boy. Girl really got no drip right now. I'm talking Which negative drip. When she stayed here. Von Crate's daughter. I she was here. Where is she now? Hmm. What? Ceres. Where's Ceres? Dunno. Dunno. Enough of the questions. Only I really asked you one. What happened to him? I say something wrong. You must forgive the Earl. Hasn't been feeling well of late. Is he sick? He didn't seem quite right during Croc's feast, but... Forgive me. I must go to him. Where's Ceres? I've got to find her. Uh, I don't know. Ask around. Y'all are hiding Great. something. Y'all are hiding something. Are they hiding something? Remember when that storm caught us in Old Bay? All right, I'm not gonna. I'm not dumb enough to check this chest right now. Ask about Saris in the village. All right. Okay. This is randomly off topic, but do you guys? Uh, uh, actually, I want to know how far in the video you guys have made it. Um, what should keyword should I say? Um. Hmm. If you guys are watching this far into the video, uh, leave uh, leave a comment goat. I'm sure some people <laughs> let's confuse all the people who have <laughs> who didn't make it this far into the video <laughs> and like just type the word goat in the comments. I don't know. <laughs> people are going to get confused. Like, Why is everybody commenting goat? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, there's there is two quests here. I got to be careful to not accidentally do one that could ruin things by pacing. All right. Greetings. Ha! Nary a soul for months. Then one day guests from afar start dropping like rain in springtime. You weary traveler. Hungry. Looking for a young woman, name of Ceres. Looking for Ceres, Jarl on Crate's daughter. Ah, you found her. Or near to. Glass was just here. Know where she might have gone? Took an interest in our Jarl. Asked about his childhood. So I told her to see Bergthora and Eirik. Hmm. Who are Bergthora and Eirik? Who are Bergthora and Eirik? Years ago, Eirik was close with the old Jarl. Was the Jarl that helped him win Bergthora's hand. They live toward the east end of the village. All right, take care. Take care. Bless you. And my blessings to Ceres when you see her. Thanks, I appreciate that. Ask about... <sighs> Wait. I could have married Does this also... Have something to do? Oh, here. Could you tell a trout? Sorry to interrupt. You need something. Come, let's have a pint of that shot. I'm looking for Ceres. Thanks, but I'm short on time. Looking for a girl named Ceres. Crack on Crate's daughter. She was here, but I've not seen her away. Take care. Take care. 
Hmm. I wonder if we can find out more info if we continue to... That's a big old dog, bro. Dang. That's a big boy. Greetings. I'm looking for someone. Bergthora. <laughs> a lucky chap you are, then. Truth be told, I'm taken. But village is brimming with lovely girls. <laughs> lovely, you say, can I meet him? Did you say lovely girls? Where? Maybe one would be willing to show me around the island. Well, there's Vea, lovely one, Cooper's daughter. Though, nah, she's got teeth like fish hooks. Dang. Oh, Deborah, there's a fine lass. Teeth bang on straight. Though, there is a growth under her right eye. Hmm. Okay. Maya's got <laughs> a right dreamy face. If not for that bit of bone rot on her right foot. Bruh. <laughs> Nuts. Now I give it a think. Well, none of these lasses are really appealing. Said me. <laughs> I'm looking for Ceres. I'm looking for Ceres. The skinny thing. Lovely doe eyes, true, and she's from an honorable house. But the lass is gaunt as a sapling. I don't know where she is, and her father. Ugh, tell Crack to calm down. No Skellige lass can perish in her own isles. All right, she was here a few hours. Went to find me man, Irish. Needed to talk, she said. They should be on the beach, t'other side of the aisle. Thanks. Take care. Good luck searching. Okay. Good luck searching. Appreciate it. Something's telling me. Something. I, I don't feel like something is bad is happening, but I am kind of curious about uh, this. Irik was part of, like, the... Oh, they're hunters. No! Oh, oh, was he mad about that? Sorry, buddy. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but yeah, Irik was the one who kind of got... Um, well, no, the old Jarl is the reason why Irik and uh, Bergthora are together. So is it because of his connection with the Jarl? That she's talking with him out here or something. Hmm. Oh, drowners. Let's uh, F5 real quick. Hello. Is that Irik up there? Hello. Oh. Oh. Oh, nope. I know some really want to see me get overpowered in this series, but to me, man, it feels so good that I nothing just dies in one hit. Baby, sure we showed him. We seem to remember you sitting on that rock crying for help. Ah, uh, but if not for me warning, you'd be herring bit about now. Bro, they're blue people. I saw them. <laughs> I saw them dudes from a mile away. Need your help. Thanks for your help. Did it once, maybe you can do it again. Well, we'll have to think about it. Busy the day me fishing got nets to mend. No time to fight monsters. It's not drowners this time. It's Ceres. I'm looking for her. Aye, fine looking girl. Can tell right away she's from a good clan. Left her sitting right here when I sailed out to bring in the morning catch. What's she asking about? Any idea why she came here? She say what she was after, or just admire the scenery. She asked about our Jarl and his family. Where'd she go? She say where she was headed. Uh, wouldn't tell a stranger, but we did risk our hides together. Went to Odeldrick's old family home. Yonder on the hill. Thanks, see ya. Thanks. Farewell. Better hope I'm not a terrible person. Because she would now be dead because of you. Okay. Um, it's telling me the easiest way. I guess let me call Roach. Roach. Oh, Roach, you really had to go through the goats, buddy? Come on. Move it. I know it says the other way is the best way, but Kingdom Ace finds his own way. I find my own way do my own things around here. Oops, sorry. I hope those weren't his goats. Uh, let's go. Something tells me I should have listened to the the thing. Okay. 
Yeah. All right. Strategic re retreat. You can do this. Come on, bro. You can do this. Get up. What was that sound? The screen shook. Was there a fight going on? This is not Skyrim. I'm not. I'm not able to to do things, bro. The model will. If if you do things it does not want you to do, it will force you back down. This is not freaking Skyrim. This is not Breath of the Wild. Literally, Breath of the War. Breath of the Wild has probably the best horses I've ever played it with in a game, bro. Like you can scale mountains with them, them dudes, bro. You can scale mountains with them because they have like the adjust feature when you like hold the trigger um, and you can literally just do that up a mountain. <laughs> yeah, I don't I definitely don't think they meant for you to be able to do that, but you can. Whoa, whoa, I guess that works. Wait. Okay, we're gonna need to view the Witcher senses. Fifth essence, torch. Okay, that was it in here. Okay. Let me F5, what a time to be alive, just in case. Damn. Something seriously wrong here. Is, is there some kind of spirit? Could be Ceres's. I have a feeling you're right. Oh, oh, key to a cellar. It's good that we check this. Even though knowing this game, there's probably like three more in here. Can I leave? Do you sound like he's right here? Way they had that that up there it looked like she was gone what happened where am i oh my head pain's just awful got hit with something heavy Geralt, why are you here came to look for you crocs worried taking you home i won't go until i help ulrich the sword where's the sword i've, I've got to go back you're not going anywhere i carried you out of there a moment ago half dead I have to. You. Why'd you go in the house? Why'd you go in there? I wanted to help Udelrek. Sure, he was acting strangely, but I don't see how your stroll through a haunted house will help him. It would have if I'd only found the sword. What's so important about this sword? So what's this sword all about? It's Brockvar, the ancestral sword of Udelrek's clan. I needed to lift the curse that holds Udelrek. A curse? Long story. Years ago, Udelrek and his little brother butted heads over the sword. As custom has it, the clan's sword should go to the firstborn son, Udelrek. But his father gave Brockfar to his little brother, Aki. Why? <laughs> Serious insult in these lands. Serious enough for Udelrek to break a sacred law here in Skellige. He openly questioned his father's decision. Guessing the old Jarl couldn't let it pass. They chained Udelrek to a pile, up to his waist in the sea. Spent three days like that. When his punishment ended, he and Aki sailed out to fish. Yeah, and I assume only Ulrich came back. They make friends. Something happened on that trip. I got a feeling this trip didn't end happily. Your feeling's right. There was an accident. A storm broke out and Aki fell overboard. Ulrich had his hands full with the sails. Didn't hear his brother until it was too late. Didn't hear or didn't want to hear. Some folk on the isle had the same doubt. But none would mention it aloud. Think Ulderic killed his brother? What do you think? Did Udoric kill Aki? I don't want to jump to any conclusions. But I do think whatever happened at sea that day, well, it's affecting Udoric right now. Powerfully so. And it could have something to do with that sword. So how long has this been afflicting him? Like, is this something recent? Or I assume not. What did you plan to do with the sword? I thought Aki's ghost would want it back. The brother's ghost? 
Long as I remember, folk have said Udelric's the chosen one. The one the gods speak to. I believed it once. But now, considering certain things, I think he's just haunted. And it's his dead brother that's haunting him. Where'd you get that idea? Daring theory. Not breaking any of your laws just by thinking it. Don't care. I don't believe it's the gods talking. Have you seen him? He's covered in scars. Thought he earned those in battle. If you call the strife in his heart and head a battle, I've asked him about it. He said the voices command him to hurt himself for the glory of the gods. I think not. It's not the gods. It's Aki. Hmm. Think Aki wants revenge against Ulderic? So you believe Aki's getting his revenge because Udelric let him die? I've talked to Yort. He swears Udelric didn't start hearing voices till after Aki's death. And I don't think Yort's mistaken. He knew both those boys from the cradle. I think we've to give Brockvar to Aki, and he'll leave Udelric alone. Not a bad idea, on condition it's a ghost we're dealing with. But something doesn't add up. What's that? Aki drowned at sea, said so yourself. But the ghost haunts this house. Yeah. Aki and Udelric both lived here. Maybe that's why. But the ghost traveled all this way. Geralt, but I've got to get the sword. You're not doing Out it alone. The question. I'll get it. Really? Thanks. So I can go see Udelric? No chance. You're weak. Might pass out again along the way. Wait here. We'll go together. Good. Okay. Stay here. She's gonna go, just go sit down. All right. Hey, there weren't that many places it can be, but I assume it's gonna be in the cellar. I did already grab the key for it. There wasn't even a door over here. So I'm gonna assume that the way to a cellar is somewhere that I didn't see previously. Hmm. Yep, I can see it already. Let me grab this first. Just some water. All right, open. I hit, hit the open. There you go. Uh oh, I didn't even move. I didn't even touch the stick. Hello. None to loot. Maybe I can set a couple little fires so it's not so dark in here. Assume this place is going to be a battlefield in a moment. All right. Sure, we don't have to worry about these candles causing a fire, especially not with all those plants hanging out right there. All right, F5. Brockvar. Whoa. What is this about? That looked a little too scripted, a little too goofy. So it's going to be from above. Dude, they could have did the nastiest jump scare if they wanted to. Bro, she's dead out of here, bro. They could have did the nastiest jump scare sword. if they wanted to. The sword? Yeah, let's go. I found it. Let's go. After you, then. You and my da, you were mates once, right? Hope we still are. But, well, I heard you fell out over something or someone. Talking about that story with Yennefer? Long time ago, that. In fact, that was before Croc met the woman who'd be your mother. But you and Yennefer had already met? <sighs> uh, things were never cut and dried with Yen. What is it about her? What is it that draws you? Dunno. Maybe uh, it's because I've never chosen comfort and ease, the calm and the quiet. <laughs> I actually like that. I kind of wanted, wanted that conversation to continue. <laughs> All right, older Rick. You're up here, right? Let's go. Oh, cutscene starting before we get back. Uh, is he just tired? I was like, why is he yawning? Is something happening? Where is Yennefer? Hmm. Don't know. Why do you ask? I just wonder why she let you come here alone. What do you mean, let me? <laughs> Not a thing. Just got the impression she doesn't like to let you out of her sight. I'm a grown man. Look, there they are. Hardly bright out here. 
Stings the eyes. The fresh air will do you good. The gods won't be pleased. <clears throat> Jarl, our guests, remember. What happened? What happened to your hand? I sacrificed it to the gods. Forgive him, Jarl. Geralt's got more to learn about our customs. We're close to the gods in Skellige, and the chummier you are, the greater the offering you make. It's our belief that the greatest thing a man can offer is his pain, his suffering, the pure sacrifice. To hear the gods is a gift, not a sacrifice. About those voices. These voices you hear. The gods, their voices. There's no easy way to say this. More likely, this is somehow related to your dead brother. Oh, oh, this, this. I told Geralt of Aki. We concluded that that the gods are angry at you. Yet he's the reason. That's why you have to apologize to Aki himself. I, I didn't want to. Aki fell in the water. I, the gods will be angry. Don't be afraid. Let me help you, and I promise to do everything I can to keep from angering the gods. Heed the Witcher Jarl. Make amends to Aki and you'll surely please the gods. Whose baby is that? What would you have me do? Remember where Aki fell in the water? Near the Isle's eastern end, by the mouth of the bay, current had swept us towards Ulula's Needle. It's a dangerous spot. Treacherous eddies swallow a handful of sailors each year. We need to sail there. Aki's ghost won't rest until Brockvar's return to his remains. No. No, no, no. The gods, they'll be angry. I feel it. Fear not, Jarl. The gods love you, and they loved Aki. Surely they want this. Well... Maybe I can sail there. The sword should be returned. That's what matters. Makes no difference by whose hand. You what really not gonna go? For? Did Aki have anything that'll help me recognize him? Something he was wearing that could survive all this time underwater? I, our clan ring. That ought to be enough. I'm off. Dang, he's really not gonna go? Got a minute? Farewell. I feel like that kind of defeats the purpose. Like, yeah, I'm sure they love him and they love Aki, but I feel like part of what makes it impactful is, you know, you finally facing this, you know? Like, like you're not even facing anything in the end. I don't know. Can we get on the boat, please? All right. Take the helm. Accelerate. All right, here we go. So it's it's actually relatively close by. Dang, man. I wonder how this is going to end. I Whoa. Still around here. Whoa. Kinda want to see what's going on over there. I kind and it's a hidden treasure. I kind of want to see this. Kind of want to see this. Just because, it, like, I mean, it, if even if it wasn't a hidden treasure, I can't do that now. Do what? Got those. Yeah, I didn't Must even have to find nice. anybody. The crooked mass marks the spot, but not any fool can find the treasure. Not only eagles there. Hello. Ooh, like that chance to burst into flames. Nope. Oh. Nope. Oh. There we go. 
more. Uh, that stench. I need you to pull that weapon back out, bro. Okay. Oh. Woo. Okay. Okay. I assume there's going to be more. Guess not. Okay. Doesn't seem to be anything too important. I didn't take the apple somehow. Okay. Well, time to get back on the boat. Back on the boat. Back on the boat. Take the helm. Now, let's set off. Actually, uh, let me hit. Let me get a ham sandwich real quick. You never know. All right. Boom. Now with a ham sandwich on my stomach, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to dive back into the water. Okay. All right. Ooh. Ooh, someone wants to play. Ow. There we go. Yeah, that's all of them. Yeah, there's no loot for these guys. Oh, my breath is already bow out, so... Can we go back up real quick? No loot. Okay. Thought I saw a red name for Siren again. Um. Let's go. I assume that's him. Oh, I guess I left the sword. Dang, bro. I'm glad I don't have to worry about this stuff. Can't help wondering what that accomplished, if anything. Time to see Ulrich. Time to go see Ulrich. Oh, hey, the other one went back. No. Time to take the helm again. All right. Time to come back around and make our way back back accelerate yeah uh i definitely just heard a scream of some kind y'all guards aren't about to do nothing what is this Ludwig. the voice has commanded him to poke out his eye what why do you do it such was the will of the gods a sacrifice for Aki. What did the gods say exactly? When did they talk to you? What did the gods want exactly? Do you remember? What did they tell you? They were angry. A voice said, you vile wretch. You didn't help Aki. And now you failed to sail out to beg his forgiveness. That's what I'm saying, bro. Suffer and regret the evil you've wrought. When did the gods talk to you? When did the gods speak to you? Right after I left? Shortly after. Sleep came over me, so I lay down. Twas then they revealed their will to me. You always asleep when they speak to you? Always. What do you see then? Do they try to summon you anywhere specific? My old home. They command me to light torches, then speak from the shadows. Hmm. 
Have you ever seen them? The gods ever show you their form, or are they always just a shadow? Once, I steeled myself, gathered my courage, and in my dream made my torch burn bright. I saw a hazy figure sitting in shadow then. Gods don't like light. Do they always demand an offering of pain? The gods speak from the shadows, you said. Is that why you don't allow any lights in here? In my dreams. At times I see their form, when the torches burn bright. To see the gods is a great honor. Maybe with more light in your house, you'd see them when you're awake as well. Lesser men are unworthy. They cannot gaze upon their faces. Do they always demand an offering of pain? The gods always demand you offer them your suffering. Only that pleases them, so they ask for more and more. Ceres, we need to talk. Oh. Yeah. Go turn the sword, but nothing's changed. It's not his brother's ghost that haunts him, tortures him. What's wrong with him? Can we talk somewhere in private? The you fig him. you figured it out, though. That's the same monster that was in the shadow there. Oh, um, all right, that's kind of comical. Come on, guys. <laughs> that's a little comical. Well, know what it is? It's a Heim, a post-conjunction creature. Very rare and very dangerous. It latches on to men who commit vile deeds. It feeds on their pain for years, fueling their guilty conscience. In the end, Heims force their victims to mutilate themselves. Sounds unpleasant. Any way to defeat it? Hmm. Two methods that work, in theory. There's the Witcher's way. You can try to trick it. They say a Heim can be tricked. You have to pretend to do something horrible. Then it'll move on to you as its new victim. When it realizes it's been tricked, it'll be forced to leave. Great. Let's try it. Don't worry anyone who's pulled it off. Maybe no one's thought of a trick that was good enough. Oh, well, we can also talk about What's the Witcher way. other way? Witcher's bestiaries say you have to spend a night in the Heim's lair with the affected individual. The haunted house, you mean? It's hardly cozy, but I wager you've slept in worse conditions. It's not about sleeping. You've got to draw the Heim out. It has to emerge from the shadows, show itself. Easier said than done. It otherwise. And it's sure to give as good as it gets. You've seen Udelric. It won't be an easy fight. I know you're doubtful, but we should at least try to find a way to trick the hang. Might not be as simple as it seems. Besides, neither method's perfect. What do mm. you mean? Uldric might not survive. Udelric might not survive an entire night in the Heim's lair. You think the Heim... Would it try to kill Udelric? No. That would mean losing its host. But Udelric could just expire. He's weak, and the house will summon painful memories. Whereas to the Heim, that'll be an opportunity. The more pain the Heim causes Udelric, the stronger it'll grow. And the more dangerous it will be to you. Hmm. And what about the other method? It's very hard to trick a Heim. The Heim's a demon, and demons are notoriously hard to fool. Plus, the trickster can't know it's a trick. What? The Heim attacks those who have a guilty conscience, truly believe they committed a foul deed. The Heim strengthens their regret and feeds on it. Meaning, if the new host doesn't feel true sorrow, the Heim will sense that. Yes. So, for this to work, if either of us has an idea, we can't tell the other one about it. Yeah. Exactly. Both methods seem risky. But I still think we should try the trick. Don't know that I'm convinced. Just please don't tell me you have to consult Yennefer on such things as well. Will you if stop we bringing her think up? Of anything, we can always try the Witcher's Way. What was that about Yennefer? Fine, let's try tricking it. Hmm. Trying the trick can't hurt. I feel like bringing up Yennefer might have been house. a better way to do the it. Heim's lair. Only place where anything like this could work. After you, then. I, I bet you, in the end, consulting Yennefer might have been the better option. I'm going to have some people commenting like, no, you didn't get the true ending of the quest. You know, like, bro, I've never played this game before, man. I'm going to make some wrong decisions, bro. And just how this game works, 
I'm sorry. There's only so much I can do, so much I can predict. You know, you know, I'm one of those guys that are always in their heads. No reason to delay. I'm constantly running the variables in my head, but I, I just can't always predict what the outcome will be because they don't always react the way I think they will. Let's let's do another hard save real quick. Um, I mean, if I have to, I guess I'll go all the way back there and redo the boat segment and stuff if it's not a passable outcome. But I'm sure you guys will let me know if I did a very terrible deed. Sure, you will let me know. Solid craftsmanship. Fitter must have been from the continent. Oh. Oh. Siri. No, it's impossible. Damn it. Looking to discourage me? Good. Means you're scared. I wonder if that would have been the same if we didn't have, um, what's his name, uh, to show us what Siri looks like Somebody as an adult. break their leg or their neck. Because we only know what that Siri looks like that now because, uh... Shattered. Udelrich must have been scared of seeing the creature just behind him. Because we only know what she looks like because he turned into her. An old cradle. Must have belonged to Udelrich or Aki. Get out! Is that, is that really her, though? I don't like it when we come to this side of the house. Geralt, come! Think I've got an idea! No, she wouldn't tell us the idea. Low key, I kind of want to go down here first. Huh, nothing. I definitely sw swore something would have been there. Dude, again, they still have the opportunity to do the nastiest jump scare of all time. Okay. Come up with anything? Yes, I have a plan. One that just might work. Can I get any details? You've got to wait for me here. I won't be long. Uh, anything else? Said yourself, you can't know the details. So no, nothing else. You simply gotta trust me. No way. <sighs> Hope you know what you're doing. So do I. I saved. So, can we start? Let's start. I'm ready. All right, I'll be back soon. In the meantime, get a fire going in the oven. I saved, so hopefully it's fine. I'm sure there's always a best, good, and bad outcome Order to some of these quests. Run into the old house. Grab her. Take him. <gasps> oh, oh. Him in the oven. Trust me. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. Oh my gosh, we gotta trust her. Take care not to hurt the child. Give me the feed. In the oven. Throw him in the oven. <gasps> Gerald, Gerald, put the, put the baby in the oven. Put him in the oven. No. No. Oh, and he put a spell on it too. You have to really trick him. You have to really trick him, bro. Ooh, whoa. Okay. Dang, he really died because of that, though. Like, we're supposed to be tricking him. We don't really need to kill these dudes. Oh. 
This is ho oh oh. Yeah, now he's gonna try to go on me. Yeah, okay. How does she trick? Aki. Oh, you named your son after your brother? The Witcher committed no crime. You'll find neither despair nor guilt here. Only shock and relief. You've been tricked. You must go. Yeah, get going. It's over. Over? We tricked the Heim. It thought I'd killed your child, abandoned you to haunt me, feed on my conscience. But when it saw the babe was whole, unharmed, it had to go. You're free, Jarl. Free? Still, still lost an eye, though. The Heim's gone. So are the voices that tortured you. Let's get out of here. Dang. I don't know why people wanted me to do the Cave What's of Dreams happening? so bad. This My one was way spreading. better than I'm that one. In a maelstrom. Geralt, you said it was over. That's just fatigue. In time, his mind will return to normal. What? What will I do now? Don't worry, it'll pass. You're disoriented, but don't worry, it'll pass. I feel as if someone's torn something from me. That's normal. The Heim was a parasite. Bonds between parasites and hosts can be strong. That's why you feel empty now. Give it a few days, weeks, you'll be fine. Thank you. I think. Farewell. Bro, if it ends with this dude jumping off the cliff or something, bro. Please don't do that. I need y'all to keep a close eye on him. I'll go with him. He seems confused. Good idea. Then what? What are your plans? I'll stay a few days, make sure he's healthy. And you? Gonna stay on speaker, Rog? Don't know yet. Gotta gather my thoughts. I'm sure Yennefer must be growing impatient. What are you bringing her up? Yen, why are you interested? What is it with you and Yennefer? Mentioned her several times already. Nothing. I've just noticed that you're often of one mind. Saying I'm henpecked. Not that you're especially different. Seems to happen to all men. Take a rowdy Skelliger, a brave knight or a tough witcher. You all end up wrapped around some woman's finger. Though I will admit you're not all bad. You trusted me, a complete stranger nearly. Few would have had the courage. I appreciate it if you didn't tell everybody in the aisles. They'll think I enjoy being dominated. <laughs> Farewell, Geralt. See you, Ceres. Got a minute? Farewell. Dang. That was an awesome quest. That was way better than like I like the Cave of Dreams was. It was it was cool. It was very neat. You know, I like the supernatural aspect of it. But I kind of feel like this quest kind of had everything from that quest from the supernatural point of view and more. <laughs> so yeah, I, I thought I thought that was kind of awesome, if I'm honest. I thought that was kind of awesome. Uh, I guess um, we really do need to continue this. Uh, this quest, I didn't fully understand where to go next. Do I go and kill the werewolf again and talk to Einar? Or do I talk to Einar and then get rid of the werewolf? Uh, hmm, not too sure. So in the next video, I'll probably uh, handle um, uh, at minimum these two. Uh, I might try to go ahead and just finish off the in wolf's clothing because that won't take us long. I'm assuming it's mostly done now, by the way, since there's only two. Looks like there's only two objectives left unless they just add more. 
Um, then I'll probably take on uh, the Lord of Und- Undvik and the Nithing. So it's this one, then this one, then this one. This one might, the Nithing might not take too long though, because it's only level 14. And like that other quest, it didn't take long. So we might do these three next. And then the, I guess the only other one I'd care about right now um, is doing the Family Blade. And we do that before we do the Ugly Baby one. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, let me, is there any contracts? There are uh, some pretty weak contracts I can do uh, as well. But um, I kind of don't want to make this video uh, uber long because I do kind of want to get it out uh, in a relatively short amount of time. Um, and I'm still tr- kind of easing my way back into videos again. Uh, thanks for you guys' patience. Again, it, it really does mean a lot. Uh, I've, again, I've explained it a lot on other social media and stuff already. So if you guys do care about that kind of thing and want future updates, whenever something may or may not happen, um, definitely join the discord server. The link is always in the description box below. Um, I tend to also post on the community tab. And if you want to be notified for those posts, you can, again, same thing with videos. It also does after you subscribe to the channel, subscribe to the channel, um, <laughs> it, it will notify you about community tab posts as well. So if I do update, I usually like to post on both of those as well. Again, I do also like to post these videos on Patreon first. I like to try to have at least some small way to give back to people who financially support the channel. And it does basically just let me be able to do this full time. So anybody who does support me on Patreon really does a lot, a lot um, for me. And I, again, I really do. I'm, I'm back now. I'm really getting back into the grind of things here now. Video is going to be super consistent. I would like to upload most days a week. Um, I, I can't guarantee every single day because my videos are kind of long and render times take a while. Edit times take a little bit longer. Um, I want to get back into streaming as well. I don't know if we'll be able to beat uh, Elden Ring and uh, get be there in time for the DLC. But when I get back to Elden Ring, I plan to finish it. So I'm just going to kind of do what I can do and try to get that done. I- I'm excited for this. And I hope you guys are, too. Um, you might see more one off videos uh, on the channel soon as well. There's a couple videos I want to do some uh, impressions of where I just kind of play the first uh, one to two hours of a game, kind of like what I did with Final Fantasy seven rebirth, but I do that a bit more. I want to get more to more JRPGs on the channel and stuff like that. That's my bread and butter. So to not be able to play su- a sub genre, I like the most on my channel kind of sucks. Um, so um, yeah. Um, again, I still haven't fully decided things with dishonored. I, I would love to finish dishonored as well. And maybe I'll just go and grind out the rest of the game, um, post it all on Patreon, and then just start quickly uploading them each day. I might do double uploads, like every time I upload a, a, a Witcher 3 or a Fallout, a Dishonored might become with it until it's done. Maybe I'll do that. Um, but I would love to also be doing a JRPG on the channel as well. Um, I haven't fully decided what I'll do yet. I'd like to do the new Trails game that's coming out just because I freaking love Trails and I feel like it needs more publicity. So I kind of feel like I owe it to the franchise <laughs> to do that. But I also wouldn't mind kind of going through my backlog of Final Fantasies that I haven't covered. And same thing with uh, Yakuza. Uh, I'm on Yakuza 7 now after finishing 6 and I feel like that'd be a really cool one to go to. So yeah, uh, but thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Kenny Mace. Remember everyone to play some games, have some fun. Enjoy your day today, and thank you guys so much for all the support.